Good day awesome folks and today I'm bringing you the Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire demo video. Um, I don't know how many videos I'm going to make out of this. I might just, I don't know, record some today and then if there's anything that I think, I don't know, if it seems like there's going to be more to do after this episode maybe I'll, I'll record another one, I don't know. But I just, I thought I'm going to play this anyway, I'm going to get it as soon as possible and play it. So why not just make a video out of it just in case any of you want to see me play it, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Anyway, without further ado, when you watch an Aura demo video you don't want to sit and see someone talking for ages with a little floating present on the screen that says Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sam special demo version, uh, you want to see them press the button. So let's press the button, I wanted to unwrap it together with you guys. Oh, it, it, it just did the level up noise. No, it didn't. No, the the noise when you find... No, it is the level up noise as well. You know, the do 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 That was glorious. That was absolutely glorious. Yes, close the suspended software. Let's get this going. I'm so hyped right now. Oh my god, I love this game so much. I remember... Um, I mean, I got the first uh, Pokemon game, Red and Blue. Well, I got Blue. When it first came out in the UK. Okay, yeah, of course, of course. We want to play the special Aorus demo in English. In game. Oh, I'll press it in a second, press it in a second. Um, I got blue when it first came out in this country, and I've been a huge fan ever since. Uh, Pre-ordered yellow from America as soon as I could, because screw region locking back in the day. Um, and then I pre-ordered all the games after that as soon as I could. But, I don't know, there was something about Ruby and Sapphire that it, it was a big one for me, because I'd followed it for so long, I'd been such a huge Pokemon fan in the 8-bit era, in the Game Boy era, and, you know, just that leap. The graphical leap, the colours, the textures, the footprints in the sand, the, the water. Ah, oh, it was all so glorious. And now to see that, to see it and be able to play it remastered like this. I mean, I know graphics aren't everything, but it's just all the other stuff they're going to add to. The new Pokemon, the new storylines. Ah, oh, let's just get going. I'm too hyped now. I, I, I'm probably, I don't even... Ah. Oh. Now, I'm sure, I hope that you guys understand that I can't put the game sounds in. I can't put the game sounds in this game because uh, I am 99.9999999 times 100% certain uh, that Nintendo will flag and pull this video before you can say HOT POTATOES! So yeah, let's just press start. Sorry about the no game sounds, but you've got my glorious silky voice. Oh, look at, look at that. Straight up teasing us flying around with Latios from the very beginning. What are you doing? Why would you do this to us? It's going to be an age and a half before we get to do that. Why? That's just cruel. Oh, this is the beginning. This isn't like... I thought this was going to be an intro video to the game, you know? Like, like, oh, like a standard intro video. But it's not. It's the start of the demo. So we're already established. We're already a trainer. We're going to have lots of mon. Uh, you know, this, this isn't going to be the game from the beginning. This is interesting. Okay. We've made it. Thank you, Latios. You've helped immensely. I don't know why Steven's British. Probably because I am. Swan! <laughs> Latios is a swan, apparently. Look at that, though. Latios, Latios sorry, looks so... G Moss Deep City! Are we finally going to get to go into space? I swear to God, if we cannot launch into space in this game, I quit. I don't really quit, but I really want it to happen. I want to go to space and meet Deoxys. I want that to be an event because I always wanted that to be a thing back in Gen 3 when I was just a little kid. Uh, this is Moss Deep City. It is a town where scientists work day and night on research, aiming to reach the great expanse of space. I have received a message from a professor I know, asking if we could come and help him. It seems that some rather bad people have been trying to steal his research results for themselves. We should hurry to the space center at once. Come with me, Orlando. <laughs> Orlando Calrissian. Orlandorus. This is the space center. The professor should be with. Oh, it's Team Aqua straight from the word go. Grr, troublemaker spotted. Cause they've gotta be pirates. Yeah, troublemaker spotted. Are you looking in the mirror, bro? You're planning to get in the way of us, Team Aqua members, aren't you? But we won't hold back. Not even if that one's a kid and you happen to totally be my ideal type of guy. I can't do a lady pirate. Hmm. Well, if you put it that way, then it looks as though we have little choice. We will have to battle our way through this. Orlando, would you lend me your strength? I want you to battle alongside me and my Pokemon. 
If you agree, then choose from these three Pokeballs. Select the Pokemon you want at your side in battle. What? So because it's the demo, Steven has given us our Pokemon? Unless, some crazy how, this is how we get our starter Pokemon. No, it can't be because, look, it's it's the, yeah, it's the second form. Um, Fire-type Combuskin, Grass-type Grovile, and the Water-type Marsh Stomp uh, is gonna be, and I know, I know, guys, I do love Mudkips. You have heard that I love, my, I like Mudkips, and that is completely accurate. Uh, but, I always pick the Grass Starter first time. I always pick the Grass Starter first time, and this is the first time for me, so I'm going to pick the Grass Starter. Yeah! Hey, Grover! How you doing, girl? Look at that! Oh! The symbol lands in the water with a splashing noise, and then the Team Aqua Grant just fades in. That is glorious! That looks amazing! Poochina? Really? <laughs> it's going to be easy. Go, Grovile! Let's do this. Whoa! Look how amazing that scenery looks! Oh! The battle screen! That looks so dynamic! The bag looks like a bag, the Pokemon looks like a Pokeball, the run looks like a shoe! Oh, that is am- Honestly, I, I love this interface. Ah, oh, and the battle background looks so much more detailed. I, think, I, don't, I don't know if it's just me being hyped as hell, but it just seems more dynamic, you know? And the textures look more detailed. Oh! Let's just battle. What have we got? We've got Leaf Blade, Aerial Ace, Agility, and Slam. We've got to go for that stab, Leaf Blade. No reason not to. We're five levels ahead as well from the word go. Oh, it's a one hit KO! Grow by LOP! Ban to Ubers. We defeated Team Aquig Run, of course. Whoa, I got defeated all too soon! What, is there a, is there a good amount of time to, to wait before being defeated? <laughs> just, I don't know. I am a little sick, so if you hear me sniffling, I'm sorry. Haha! <laughs> Doesn't matter if you beat us now, you're already too late. We, Team Aqua, have already figured out where to find that Mega Evolving Pokemon. Oh, they're after Mega Evolution this time. Interesting. Alright, time for us to set sail for that island. Ooh -hoo 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 -hoo. Mysterious! What island? My goodness, if it isn't young Steven. So you came by to rescue us, asked. I, I do thank you for that. No need to thank me, and I was not alone. This is Orlando. He helped me battle those thugs. Together, we sent them running. Indeed, indeed. I owe you as well, Orlando. <laughs> I'm sure I have you to thank for no one's getting seriously hurt. However, it appears that the situation is already desperate. That team something or other was just here, that who was just here, stole something of our findings about Mega Evolution. They have even learned the location of a certain Pokemon that is capable of Mega Evolution. Ooh. I'm afraid the Pokemon will be captured by these criminally inclined wretches. Oh, what a vocabulary. I see. That is not something we can ignore. Orlando, I have a favor to ask. Please, come with me. Come and help me protect that Pokemon from these thieves. Oh, we get to protect the Mega Evolving Pokemon in the demo, for real? Is this, is this some specially made, sort of linear demo storyline? Is that what this is? Maybe you get extra every day, because I've heard if you play it every day, extra stuff happens? I've gotten the coordinates from the professor, so I know which direction to go. As soon as you feel ready, speak with me. Oh, so we get to have a look around, not even bad. I am so glad I put the, bo the bottom screen in. Pokemon News is on the buzz nav right now, whatever that is. That is amazing. Let's just take a quick look at this, guys. Let's take a quick look at the bottom screen, shall we? Let's make that bigger. Oh, nope. <laughs> there we go. Check that out! Buzznav! The Lava Ridge Hot Springs, where smiles spring forth as warmly as our volcanic waters. Oh, wow. Aha! Pokemon! Some of the Pokemon that appear in a Pokemon Mega Ring and Ruby Beard Necker Chef are different. <laughs> Trade Pokemon with your friends and collect them all. Well, thanks for that pro tip. Is that the bag? Okay, so we've just got Grovile right now, but I've heard people, uh, other people playing the demo have a butt ton of Mon, so I'm quite excited. What, what, let's have a look at this. Let's have a look at Grovile properly, shall we? He is a plus defense minus bedeath nature. What is that nature again? I forget. Attack's not looking too bad. Special attack is definitely his forte, though. Obviously, the speed is nice. Where does it say, where does it say what nature we are? 
Hello. <laughs> oh, there we go. Lax. I thought Lax lowered speed. Okay. Okay. There goes my Pokemon uh, credibility right there. Okay, let's get this shrunk back down. Yeah, that looks good. That looks good. Okay, let's get back on with things. Let's see what's going down. Let's look at our first sign, guys. Is it sad that I'm excited to read a sign and just to see what the interface looks like? Oh, look at that moving electronic sign on the Pokemon Center. I bet the Pokemon Centers and Pokemon Marts are going to be separated again. Moss Deep City, our slogan, cherish Pokemon. I like these guys. All right, well, hello. I'll let me guess, maintenance work in the Mart. Big Brother, uh, no, I mean Mr. Manager, thank you for all you've taught me. I will carry on your lecture for new trainers with pride, just as you taught me, Mr. Manager. Oh, no, okay, I thought you'd give me some new text, never mind. Hello, buddy. Little brother, no, I, uh, I mean, trusty employee. You may be going to Old Dale Town now, but I hope you'll carry on and give the lecture to any new trainers you meet there. So, so no Pokemon. Well, glorious. Let's have a look at this funky house. The door is locked. Well, isn't that just nice? A first for the Pokemon series. Well, maybe not a first, but it's definitely an uncommon occurrence. This door is locked too. I think you're trying to tell us something here, Nintendo Freak. Can we, can we, no, we can't surf, obviously. What's going on down here? Have we got like an item finder? Yeah, what, yeah, what's going on with the bag, actually? What items do we have? Hyper Potion, full heal, nothing, nothing, nothing. Okay, so no key items. This should be fun. <laughs> I could just, like, tap A and hope to find an item, but no. Let's not waste each other's time, shall we? Let's run around here. Maybe we'll find something cool. Maybe we'll find a Pokemon battle. No, maybe we'll find nothing. <laughs> hey, hey, the glass is half full, guys. I am an optimist, okay? Is that all right? <laughs> oh, a person. Hello. The guy who lives in that house, Steven, is always giving me weird stones. Is collecting rocks really all that fun? I don't get it. <laughs> You're right, kid. It's, it is strange. What in the world? There's something here, but I can't see anything. I can't even get into Steven's house. Is this some kind of Pokemon trick? Kecleon, in before Kek. Yeah, in before Kek. Troll Kek is troll. Did I already check this one? Yeah, I probably did. I'm too excited. <laughs> My Steep City Pokemon Gym! The Mystic Combination, Liza and Tate. Can we, can we please battle Lyser and Tate? I can't wait to take these guys on. These guys were so hard the first time I battled them, but I honestly, I didn't get KO'd. I actually managed to win first time. What's going down? Oh, hello. No, 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 not the gym. You can't go in. Uh, okay, guys, okay. Sorry, I apologize for being a Pokemon trainer. I wanted to get into a Pokemon gym. All right, so Steven's kind of trolling us, telling us to come and find him when we're ready. Uh, when there's really no reason other than admiring the beautiful scenery for us to be uh, even going through this area. Oh, hello. In the Navy, you can sail the seven seas. I heard from my mates in Lico that her, the herd of Whalmer has disappeared. I wonder what went down over there. I'm guessing it was probably me. Probably me. This rock has a special meaning to the people at the Space Center. They put it here as their wish for their rocks to fly safely. When you make a wish, what do you use? Do you wish upon a star? I use a wish tag to make it happen. That's what I do. It's a white rock. There's also a white rock in Hoenn, guys. You know what that means. <laughs> oh, lol jokes. Oh, hello. This looks so good. Look at it all. A voyage on the ship is fine, but crossing the sea with Pokemon using surf. Now that's an exhilarating trip. Wouldn't you agree, youngster? Of course I would. Of course I would. Look at how grand it all looks. Musty feels so much bigger, so much more fleshed out. Like, what is. Oh, that's the rocket! Oh my god, we're actually down at the rocket right now, the launch site. The fact that we can get right down here gives me hope. I mean, I know they're likely to do that anyway, just to make the area seem more rich and detailed and, you know, help to justify the leap, uh, you know, the remake. But, I don't know, man. The fact that they put that rocket site in there and we can get right down to it, it gives me hope that we can actually see that rocket blast off. Maybe Team Rocket will appear, that would be amazing. Team Magma? Team Aqua? What could such ruffians plan to do with my own research? I am not strong enough to go and after them and stop them. I know I'm really springing this on you, but would you go with Steven and put a stop to their evil plots? I'm counting on you, Orlando. <laughs> Bar Steep Space Center, the closest place to space. Oh. 
Sorry, sorry, sorry. Can we just take a look at that slow saunter again? Look at that. What is that about? That's in Pink Panther Creep. What? <laughs> what? What is going on? This is amazing. All right, let's go to Steven. Let's go to Steven. I have wasted enough of our time. I'm sorry, guys. I just love to explore everything. When I do an Aura playthrough, this is what you can expect. So, uh, sorry. Looks like you're ready. Shall we go help that Pokemon? Let's have an adventure! Understood. Then shall we go? Oh my god! Look at this! Now the rumor is, I'm not sure if it's 100% confirmed, but the rumor is that we can free fly around Hoenn on Pokemon. You know, not just fly from location to location instantly with a, instantly with a little animation, but control it. You know, like a, like an airship in an RPG, you know, when you fly around. In one of, like in Final Fantasy VII, for instance, and many other Final Fantasies. Now then, I expect Team Magma and Team Aqua have beat us here in the search for that Pokemon. Orlando, <laughs> can I ask you to start by having a look around? I'm sure that those fool teams will be around here somewhere. Ah yes, a word of warning. If you step into the tall grass there, a wild Pokemon may attack you. Be sure you are ready for them. Oh, don't worry. We were born ready. Can we go this way? Okay. You just stand in there arbitrarily. You know, you know what? Mr. Champion isn't going to come along and help us. Okay. Let's get into a wild battle. We have no balls, though. How are other people in this demo getting mon? Oh, guys. Guys. Oh, Slack Off! I love Slack Off. Slack Off is one of my favorite mon. He's so damn adorable, and I love sloths. They're so cute, so kawaii. Do we have any Pokeballs? We don't, do we? Oh god damn! Uh, guys, guys, the battle music is, is is the same battle music from Ruby and Sapphire, but it's, it's it's got added layers, the tempo's up, it's just more energetic, you know? It makes you want to go for it, so let's go for it. Uh, we can't catch you, buddy, unfortunately, even though you're adorable, look at his little face. So let's just go for an area lace. Not an area lace, a leaf blade. Look at that! Oh! That animation, it, I don't know, maybe I'm just being an idiot, maybe I'm just fanboying, but to me, it looks better. The animations look better, it looks cleaner, it looks more detailed, I don't know, I don't know, maybe I'm being an idiot. Eriolesu! I can't believe that didn't KO, and that did hefty damage when Slackoff attacked us, this is worrying. Will Steven heal us, that is the question, let's go find out. Hmm. Your Pokemon look a bit tired, Orlando. <laughs> Allow me to help restore them to health. Yeah! Should we level up Grovile to, like, level 100? <laughs> Should we just have a grinding montage? <laughs> oh, sorry, I'm skipping text. Orlando, <laughs> I want you to go farther into the island and begin the search. Once I finish my preparations, I will follow you, follow after you at once. Why? What do you have to prepare, man? <laughs> I don't get it. A wild noon appeared. Go, Grovile! I don't know why I said it like that. <laughs> Alright, let's Leaf Blade! <laughs> In before Bandit Extreme Speed. <laughs> Covet? Why? Why are you all using Covet? Can you just stop that, please? Thanks, please. Emulation! What? That didn't KO. That didn't KO, guys. That didn't KO. Okay. Okay. Probably shouldn't have gone for another one. That might not even KO. <laughs> that is unbelievable. Holy crap baskets. <laughs> Seriously. Seriously. I'm going to battle another wild Pokemon or two and then get healed up. I think that's a good idea. Oh no, let's just get healed up now and go on to Team Magma. Let's do that. I don't want to waste time. Someone on this island is a Pokemon capable of Mega Evolution. We simply cannot hand it over to Team Magma or Team Aqua. Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't worry, bruh. We got this. We got this. Bam, 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 bam. What you guys gonna do? We're gonna make slag out of you, Magma. Ridiculous! No one warned me about this! But to think Team Aqua would also show up looking for that Mega Evolving Pokemon. And that girl just now. Why is a strong trainer like her here? What should we do now? Oh, Wibble. <laughs> Wibble? What are you acting so afraid for? We've got nothing to worry about. We've got our admin Tabitha. Hmm? Yeah, more interference. Darn 
want it? Why does everyone keep wanting to get in Team Magma's way? I... I, I won't let you get away with it! Fusion! <laughs> Did you see him start the fusion dance there? Oh, look at this! Look at that explosive background, I assure you. The sound effect accompanying it was glorious! Oh my god. Zubat, okay. Okay, we could be in a little bit of trouble here. Let's go for... <laughs> I don't know. What has the higher base power? I think... Let's have a look here. Let's have a look here. Oh, I should have checked moves, idiot. Okay. So we got Leaf Blade, which is 90. So that, uh, that'd be half. No, it'd be quartered. So Aerial Lace is 60. And Slam is 80. So we're going to go for Slam. Screw the accuracy. We're just going to go for it. I believe in you, Grow Vile. I know we've known each other for only a few minutes, but I, I feel your power. Yes. Nice. Get slammed. Oh, and he lives it. And Leech Life is going to get a, a nice chunk of health back because that's going to be super fun. Oh, no, it doesn't. Wow. I suppose we do have a plus defense nature. <laughs> Lacks coming through. Not bad. Not bad. Alright. Let's go for an to finish this guy off because I'm not risking a miss now. Slam should take care of business. Not Slam, sorry. Aerial Ace. Nice. Good game, Magma Grunt. Oh, I love that music. What? I lost? Holando <laughs> received a lot of money for winning. Ridiculous! No one warned me about this! No one told me you'd be so strong! Wibble! <laughs> <laughs> Not too bad for a little kid! Fine! An ace grunt like me will take care of you in the flashiest of flashes! Fusion! <laughs> Ho! I know it's hot, but I kind of mixed the Thundercats in there. Sue me. Anubal! Okay! Okay! This could be troublesome. Um, I still think a neutral stab leaf blade is going to be the best attack to go for right here. So let's do that. <laughs> in before Lava Plume. No, we one-shot the Noomal. Not even bad. Fantastic job, Grovile, you legend. And we got our first level up. Did you see that level up flash? That looked beautiful. Grovile grew to level 36. Are we going to let him evolve straight away? Are we going to let him evolve straight away? Huh? I lost! Orlando received lots of money. Yeah! What? Grovile is evolving! Look at that background. Oh, Grovile. Your strength shines forth so early, my friend. Perceptile! <laughs> nice! Thunderbolt me, bitch! It ain't gonna happen! <laughs> Yeah! Look at you, you glorious creature! Oh! I love Sceptile so much. He looks amazing, that badass tail. Now he's got a Mega, which is going to be even more powerful. He's agile, he's got a good move pool. I don't know why he's in such a low tier. You, oh, you look beautiful, Sceptile. Hey, baby. I'm going to have to stop playing in about 10, 15 minutes because I've got to get ready to go to work soon, which really blows! Ah -ha -ha! Tempted to call a sicky, but I won't. Uh, but yeah, I will be playing more of this later on today, and I'll probably upload two videos today of it, to be honest, because it looks so much fun. Anyway, what? What do you mean you're not Team Aqua? Huh? You're here to protect that Pokemon? Now that you mention it, that girl who beat us before was saying something like that. Sheesh, everyone sure does get excited when it's a mega evolving Pokemon, huh? No, we'd like to protect all Pokemon, buddy. Dirtbags. Team Magma is working to expand the land so that we humans have more space to develop. In order to do that, we need the power of Mega Evolution and the super ancient Pokemon. We must have the transcendent power of Primal Reversion. Primal Reversion confirmed! So it's not Devolution, it's Reversion. I think a lot of Pokemon could get a Primal form. I am hoping that Relicanth gets one, it makes sense. And the Fossilmon. We want to expand the land and Team Magma wants to expand the sea making us natural enemies. Expanding the land makes the sea shrink. Expanding the sea makes the land shrink. It's one of those things, you know? Uh, what do you call it? Uh, catch 22! Okay, I wonder if Steven's satisfied now. Let's go see him. Are you ready yet? Oh, God damn it, Steven! Steven! Steven, brah! Come on! Come on! Oh, no! No, no! We d yeah, yeah, okay, please, thank you. <laughs> Let's do this! Hey, it's me! 
or probably Jemima or like Florida or something now. I don't know. You jerks! You think two on one is a fair battle? You call yourselves adults too. Never mind your weird outfits and those stripes. Uh, are, uh, are we being unfair? Do I really look weird? You nitwit, why are you acting so shocked? It's fine. We and Team Act will do what we must in order to help Pokemon, got it? That means we can be unfair or as bad as we have to be. And I don't know about you, but I totally rock my uniform. Do you see this, Midwit? <laughs> I've got more style than I know what to do with. <laughs> Excuse my coughing, I'm still pretty sick. What? Orlando, why are you here? <laughs> Orlando. What? Another brat? Fine then. I'll show you why people compare us in Team Aqua to Moiti Poseidon. I'll take you on mano a mano, fair and square. Bam, 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 bam. That is so freaking glorious. Uh. Oh, I love it so much. Team Aqua Grunt sent out Puccina. Team Aqua Grunt is about to get wrecked by my septile. Gonna call you rectile. No, cause that sounds like rectile. Is in rectile dysfunction or in the anus. Gonna use Leaf Blade. That's gonna be a one hit KO. Yep. Hopefully these battles get a bit harder soon actually. It'd be nice to get a bit more diversity in the team. We defeated Team Aqua Grunt. Grr, I lost it. Orlando received money. <sighs> Maybe mano a mano wasn't such a hot idea. I oh, know what? You're pathetic. I can't do a girl pirate. I'll work on it. I'm sorry. Fine. I ranked as the 25th highest grunt in Team Aqua. We'll clean up this mess. For you in no time. Whoops. <laughs> bam, 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 ba dam, 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 dam. Sorry, I'm really hyper, I'm really hyper, I'm really hyper. Okay, Team Aqua Grunt, let's go. Cabana! Alright, good game, Cabana, because, you know, you're about to get wrecked so hard. You're not going to outspeed Sceptile. No way. Sceptile is the speed demon. Let's outspeed a Leaf Blade, buddy. Oh, yeah, look at that brutal blade. Nice. Rough skin, no speed boost. Scrub. Scrub. <laughs> Team Aqua Scrub. Oh yeah. Huh? I lost! Or Orlando Money Blah. <laughs> I didn't think you'd be so good at drawing out your Pokemon's power. I'll be listening, listing your name in our notebook of troublesome opponents after this. So beware. Thanks for helping out, Orlando. Oh, your Pokemon's looking a bit tired there. Let me heal it right up for you. There, ready for action! My dad asked me to come to this island to survey some Pokemon that supposedly lives here. With all these weirdos decked out in red and blue trying to go after the local Pokemon, I couldn't just stand back and watch, you know? But there's a couple of guys ahead who seem way stronger than the two we just faced. I guess they're the bosses or something. I tried to fight them, but me and my team didn't stand a chance. But you and your Pokemon, Orlando, you might be able to win where I couldn't. Don't push it too hard, though. Crush your heart, okay? Huh? What? Okay. <laughs> what does this rock do? Nothing. Why are you here, rock? But, but is my outfit really that weird? Life comes from the seas, and all living things depend on the seas. Both Pokemon and people. To explain, we and Team Aqua are trying to help expand those seas, so that more new life can grow. So that more Pokemon can be born. We want to expand the ocean of life. Yeah, it all sounds very noble, but let's face it, guys, you are far from noble. Come on, please. A Loudred, look at those glorious speaker ears. Speak ears, yeah. All right, we might not even one-shot this thing because it's surprisingly bulky. But no, we're Sceptile now. We we are one-shot this badass. I wish we could capture you, though, buddy. I really do. Good game, Loudred. We gain much experience. Let's go. Oh! Here we go. Time for some voices. 
You there, oversized brute, clear the path. We, the mighty Team Magma, will be the ones to obtain the mega evolving Pokemon. Ha <laughs> ha What, you gotta screw loose or something? Look at you, little Makuhita man! <laughs> what, what I have never been so humiliated! You compare me, Tabitha, the next chief admin of Team Magma, to a Makuhita? You'd better at least make it a Hariyama! Oh, ha ha ha! You're pretty funny, little man! I love funny, interesting dudes, that's why I love my bro Archie. Let's smash him out with a battle. I'm gonna love you to bits. I don't understand this brute at all. Frightening. It looks as though I have no choice. I'll give you a good taste of the overwhelming power an admin wields. Oh, ho, ho. sounds pretty interesting. Nope, sounds pretty fun. Come at me, little man. Ho! Oh, huh? Who is this? Mm hmm. Seems like that child's here to get in our way. Making this no time for me to be picking fights with oversized brutes. My friend, I suggest we call a temporary truce. Let's work together to wipe out this meddling child. Oh ho! Good idea, bro. That's my funny little man. You, me, and our Pokemon are gonna have a real good time together. A no hold barred barrage, bro! Oh ho! Oh ha 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 ha! This one is proving to be quite a handful. Let's crush this impudent child! Oh ha ha ha! Good kid! Now let's rough you up real nice! Orlando! I'm sorry it took me so long, Orlando. And now I see what we have here. So these are some of the bosses of Team Magma and Team Aqua. I admit I am a bit surprised to see them joining forces. It matters little. We will battle together, Orlando. Before we do, though, let me teach your Sceptile a little something. Sceptile forgot how to use agility and learned Frenzy Plan. What? You taught my Pokemon a move? Bitch, I did not agree with this. And this is for you. Oh, Mega Stones! Go, go, baby! We got the Mega Bracelet, not even bad. Mega Sceptile's about to come through. The Mega Bracelet that I just gave you is set with a mysterious stone, known as a Keystone. It is a stone with the power to bind you and your Pokémon together, and yes. Ah, yes, and we should give your Sceptile this to hold as well. Yeah, Sceptile Light! Let's go! With the keystone you hold and the mega stone Sceptile now holds, the bonds that tie you two together from the 45 minutes you spent together should now allow you to draw forth the great power of Mega Evolution. Don't you feel it's time we tested that power? Yeah, <laughs> I pray you don't under- Oh no, wait, that's the wrong guy. God damn it, give me a differently colored text box, why don't you? <laughs> I pray, I pray you don't underestimate me. Admin Tabitha of Team Magma is not about to fall for any last minute trickery. Ho ha ha ha! You two look pretty fun too! I'm gonna enjoy pummeling you. Oh! Look at this, look at this, this looks amazing! That guy is so buff! Holy crap, Tabitha and Matt! Didn't expect him to be called Matt. That just doesn't sound brawny enough, you know? Yeah, what do they got? One Pokemon each? How fortunate. Camera up and Sharpedo. That is not good. That is it gonna be a mega camera up to the mega Sharpedo? Is it gonna be a mega camera up to the mega Sharpedo? <coughs> no, it can't be. It can't be. It can't be a mega camera up to the mega Sharpedo because by the sounds of it, they don't have the power of Mega Revolution yet. Surely. Or do they? Do they just not have the power of Mega Revolution for certain Pokemon that they need? I don't know. Anyway, anyway, Mega Evolution, guys. Mega Evolution Frenzy Plant on on the Sharpedo. Why not? Just because I want to see Frenzy Plant. Let's do this. Sceptile Light. Let's go. Sceptile. Let's do this, buddy. Mega Shinku. Let's go. Oh, look at that. 
He turns around, he faces the other way. Not even bad. So the power is in the tail then. Mega Metagross. Oh, how glorious does it look? Let's do this. It's a one hit KO on the Sharpedo. Yeah! Amazing! We didn't even need to use Frenzy Plant. We could have used Leaf Blade, but I just really wanted to see it. We didn't gain much XP for that. Why? That's so weird. Oh, because it's a multi battle, of course. Oh! Oh! That was beautiful! Absolutely destroyed. Yeah? Oh ho! That's a loss I can be proud of! Ha! Orlando money stuff. <laughs> Aya! How could this be? For an admin like me to lose to some child and a silver haired pretty boy. My evaluation from Leader Maxi will surely go down if he learns of this. Oh ho ho, your fellows are strong. I can't get enough of you. Your fellows, I meant you fellows. Remember this moment, child. And you there, pretty boy. Someday I'll pay you back for this. <laughs> oh ha ha ha! I'll be looking forward to meeting you two again. They're just so chill. They don't, they don't even care that they just got whomped. They're just walking out, nice and casual. Good work, Orlando. That was a perfect mega evolution. It held such strength, even though this was your first time using it in battle. I'm practically trembling with excitement at the limitless potential I sense in you. What did you think of my Metagross? Its rugged white body, so cool to the touch. Its beauty grows with mega evolution. Yes, I think the day may come when I will be able to entrust this Metagross to you. What? You're going to give us your Metagross? Dude, why not just give us a Beldum or something? But now we have scared off the crooks. So shall we go and meet the Pokemon said to be capable of Mega Evolution? I'm so excited. What is it? What is the Mon? Are you going to make me walk around? Right, guys, I am really super sorry. But because there's loads of walking around and potential random encounters and stuff to do, I am going to end the episode here, but I'll probably put up the second one today anyway. I'm not doing it for the views, I promise. But I've got to leave for work in 20 minutes and I haven't eaten and I haven't uh, gotten dressed or, you know, washed or anything. I am a scrub right now, literally. So, I am going to end the episode here. Let me know what you thought. Let me know how hyped you are for Auras. Let me know if you uh, like me doing the voices during the uh, the demo. And if you'd like to see that translate to the playthrough, let me know if there's anything you did or didn't like about certain voices. If you'd like to see any them done differently. Uh, just let me know if there's anything that you didn't like about the way I presented it uh, so that I can try and work on that for the full game. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys for coming by and watching. I hope that you've got your hands on a demo. If you haven't, I am really sorry. I will put uh, a link in the description um, to a video detailing how to get the demo if I can find one. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys for coming by. Let me know what you thought. I'm so hyped for more. Uh, I think we're going to have more every day. That is the the, uh, the impression I get with this demo. Uh, but I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, I love you guys. Have a awesome day. Goodbye.